Right. Thank you, Vince. Okay, how's everyone doing today? Awesome, awesome. So here's the trick I'm gonna show you, all right? Everyone paying attention, this is a PowerPoint trick. It usually wows. Usually I get a, ooh. Ready? If you hit the B button, it blanks out the screen. Anybody know that? No? So look at that, that's value. You already got value today. Uh, but my name is Bob Dixon, and I work with Dale Carnegie Training. How many people have heard of Dale Carnegie Training in the past? Excellent, excellent. I know I've seen a few of you before. Dale Carnegie Training is the longest and oldest training company in the world. We just turned 100. And what we do is we get results for our clients. Uh, everything is based off the book, How to Win Friends and Influence People. How many people have heard of that book? Anybody read it? All right, excellent. So what we're going to talk about today is how to create presentations that wow. Because that's one of the core skills, the core values that we offer in our programs. So we've come up over the course of time with some really easy things that you can do to create those presentations that wow. We're going to show you some ways to add some zip and some pop to your presentations. That most people think of presentations as getting up in front of a large group or a bigger group and giving a, a prepared talk. You can give a presentation to one or two people, and most people have to do that on a regular basis. And a lot of times what happens with presentations is people will sit down and they'll think about the words that they have to say. But they don't think about all the other aspects that go into a presentation. So we're gonna go over six ways to prepare for a presentation today. Now, one of the things that I get is when we, we talk to people about giving presentations, is they always focus on how scared they are. All things considered, when it comes to public speaking, I would rather be what? What do you think? What's that? Dead, all right. Just come right out and say it. All right, what else? There was a survey done by the Wall Street Journal. And in this survey, they surveyed 200 large company vice presidents. So only 7% is focused on the words. Here's the, uh, the six things that we're going to be working on today. These are the six preparation questions that you can ask yourself when you're preparing a presentation. How many people would find it really valuable to learn a skill that they could carry on a conversation indefinitely? How many people would find that valuable? There's a white picket fence running all the way around the yard of that. You see that? All the way around the yard. You know, imagine whatever your yard looks like, but a white picket fence going all the way around. I'm going to ask you to stand up and find that partner. The taller person will start asking questions of the other person, okay? Okay. So what'd you think? How was that exercise? You guys haven't even stopped talking yet. How was it, good? Yeah? How many people found out some really fascinating things about your partner? Look around, make sure your partner's hand is raised. <laughs> All right.